Hey, what's going on everyone? Welcome to the Nine Miles As Seen on TV and Gadget Review Channel. Food review channel as well. Uh, today I'm going to review a product. Actually, my Hostess Cupcakes yesterday yesterday were actually really popular. It was actually a really popular review. So going to do a follow-up to that. These are the Twinkies Cotton Candy. Uh, so they're Hostess Cotton Candy Twinkies. And yeah, these were in the sales section of my local Kroger store or the clearance section, I should say. And they were only 89 cents. I think most Kroger stores have a clearance section, so definitely check it out if you haven't. But yeah, you get 10 individually wrapped cakes, golden sponge cake with artificially flavored cotton candy, candy, uh, candy, creamy filling, it says, 89 cents. It's a limited edition. Yeah, more cake. Yeah. The health food continues on the channel. We got Mona, we got Bill. How's it going? Um, so yeah, these are 10 and you get it for 89 cents. Each one of these cakes is 280 calories. It's um, more sugar than the, the, the Hostess cupcakes. So, wow, look at that. 31 grams of sugar per... Actually, no, never mind. Okay, never mind. Two cakes is a serving size. That's interesting. There's two cakes, not just one. Uh, so, two cakes is 31 grams of sugar. So, I guess that's 62% of your daily allowance. I'm not sure why the serving is two. Like, does... I think people just need one normally, right? Uh, you have 370 milligrams of sodium, 35 milligrams of cholesterol. The first ingredient, no surprise there, is sugar, water-enriched flour, wheat flour, malted barley, and on and on. So if you want to take a look at the ingredients, you probably have to screenshot that. But there you go. Those are the ingredients. And this is the Hostess lineup. A lot of people, or not a lot of people, but some people said their favorite were snowballs. So we got the, the Twinkies, um, Got the cupcakes. These are my favorite. Aren't these called like ding dongs? You have the donuts. You have, I'm not sure what those are. Just regular donuts. They don't have snowballs. Ah, yeah. Sugar rush. Zingers. I guess that's, a, is that a zinger right there? <laughs> uh, but my favorite is this one. Hands down. I don't think there's any comparison. That's my opinion. All right. So let's open up, see what's inside. Weren't they saying they were gonna like discontinue twi Twinkies or something? There was like a big controversy like many years ago, or a few like five years ago, or maybe it was like four years ago about Twinkies. But they're still around, and they have limited edition flavors now. So this is what they look like. I'm gonna get a plate and show you what they look like. Maybe cotton candy is an improvement on the original flavor. I think one thing I do like about Twinkies in general or just any Hostess product is if you are blindfolded and you tasted a Twinkie or a Hostess uh, baked good or whatever these are, uh, whatever these are, you could probably recognize that classic Hostess taste. So a lot of the flavor for me comes in like the cake. It's not, it's not the toppings. It's not anything like that. You can identify a Hostess product. All right, so here we go. Yeah, the, the frosting. I agree. All right, hot frosting and filling. So you got the, right there, you got the filling, cotton candy, the three little, uh, wherever the machine goes in here, and it, you know, puts the uh, filling in there. But yeah, that's what they look like. Look pretty good. And I'm just going to cut it off a little bite here. It's almost like sushi. It's like a sushi roll. All right, so here we go. Three, two, one. Twinkies, cotton candy, limited edition. How does it taste? Oh, my God. That is a sugar rush. That is... That's on the level of like those... I mean, I've mentioned this in other reviews, but the store-bought cakes are really cheap. Store-bought cakes are... The frosting is so sweet, you almost feel sick when you eat it, and you're like, you, uh, you want to spit it out. Uh, that's close to what this tastes like. This is like super uh, chocolate Twinkies. Yeah, this is like probably the most sugary uh, hostess item I've ever uh, re or tasted, not just reviewed. 
Oh, they've done something to the regular Twinkies. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah, I remember there was a huge run on, like, Twinkies, or at least the, there was, like, a manufactured crisis, you know, like, about uh, Twinkies being somehow disappearing. So, like, oh, actually got, a uh, like, a white elephant gift. Someone wrapped up a Twinkies box, and, and I ended up getting it. So, it was, like, but I was all in line with these, like, all these reports about Twinkies going away or something. So, I guess they changed the recipe. Um, I'm not a Twinkie fan normally, and these are like, these are not good. Uh, unless you really like the cotton, Rick, sweet cotton candy. It's almost like, this is exactly what it's like. Biting into a, a big thing of cotton candy that you get at like a baseball game. And, uh, that's what it tastes like. Twinkies never go bad. <laughs> I would believe it. I believe it. All right, let me taste it one more time. Yeah, not good. Um, you can taste a little bit of the cake, which I like. But overall, it's just way too sweet. Uh, this is from Kroger. Um, it's a limited edition, so I I'm, I'm think they got rid of their... It's like eating cake frosting. Yeah, that's what it's like. But, I mean, I think some people do like uh, really, 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 really sweet stuff. I mean, they wouldn't sell cotton candy... If it wasn't for that, I just think for me, it's like you get past a certain stage, you know, like when you're younger and then you no longer like really want that kind of stuff anymore. So, uh, <clears throat> yeah, it's an interesting item. Cotton candy Twinkies decided to try it out. I love sugar, but that's too much. Yeah. Maybe try it out. If you really like, like really sweet like in your face kind of like sweetness that almost is a level of like artificial. Like if I took a spoonful of regular sugar, it's probably more, it's, it's less sweet than this, you know, that type of thing. Maybe go for it. Uh, I like Twinkies, but this is, isn't for me. Oh my God. Yeah. There's a lot of comments. Yeah. I think you commented about the prices in New York city. Um, that's interesting. <laughs> Sorry, everybody. Uh, I'm in an expensive area, and 89 cents, you can still find some deals. Um, but it sounds like New York City's prices are much higher, and I believe it. I still want that picture of Dis <laughs> yeah, Daisy Duck. Yeah. And let me just show you the box that I reviewed yesterday. So these were really good. These weren't overly sweet or tasting uh, vanilla cupcakes. I actually like these. I'm a fan of this, uh, you know, the chocolate ones anyway. So these were good. The limited edition vanilla. But the cotton candy, not so good. Let me just, I'm going to open another one up. Let's cut it lengthwise. All right, check that out. They loaded up with filling. So that's good. I bet a bunch of customers are like, not enough filling. I don't remember Twinkies having this much filling. That's pretty good. How, how are there? Not a fan of these. Regular Twinkies are better. But yeah, there you go. But thanks for watching everyone. Once again, these are the Hostess Cotton Candy Twinkies. Don't recommend them. Regular Twinkies are better. And yeah, more reviews coming soon. Until next time, I'll see you later.